what's going through your mind at the right first now? six holes um, when you were uh, when you were thinking you know things might be in trouble here, and then all of a sudden things start turning around? Right. You know, I was I was I was really the first couple bad club selections, and I tried to be aggressive, but the bad bad club selections they got me in too much trouble. Um, so I just like you know I'm hitting everything crisp. I'm, I'm just hitting it deep, hitting it a little too deep. So I just started you know just backing off a little bit on the irons and. And finally figured it out through through after hole number six, and uh, and got it going. Yeah, is this type of course that has that tight of margin for error? When you know certainly a high score or a low score can be only just a little bit of a difference in your game. Oh, I, yeah, ex definitely. I mean, there was a couple of my playing partners. Um, each of them a couple times had you know laying up shots in their five, in the fairway, you know five yards off center. And they got trees, you know, hanging over, and they're in trouble, you know. And that's that's a stroke or two out here, you know. Um, so yeah, it's you got to keep it right down the middle. And if you do that, you know, hit the hit the greens, and you can score well. And you know, when you got back to, to after the first nine holes, maybe you got a chance to look at the score, and maybe you didn't. But uh, scores certainly were not very low here. I mean, you're one under. You're basically in second or third place, probably yep. top five at the end of the day. Yep. And yeah, it's got to feel pretty good after that start to be in that kind of oh, position. Oh yeah, I was yeah I was I got I was three over after nine. And uh, I, yeah, I didn't look, um, and then I made, I stuck that one on 10, I made birdie there, um, stuffed one on 11, almost, almost went in, and I made a, made a birdie there, and uh, made a great par save on 12. I played from, is it 16, 16 fairway, and uh, made a great par there, and then uh, the guy, uh, the score after 12 said, yeah, a lot of the, you know, 41s, 40s, 40s, there's not, Sorensen played dynamite on the first nine. Um, but then I made two birdies right after that back to back, and I'm like, all right, I'm in it. You know, I'm this is right where I want to be. So, and then I played pretty solid, pretty solid down the stretch. Maybe, maybe missed two birdie putts after that. Uh, that maybe could have went in that were manageable, but yeah, it was, uh, it was a pretty solid day. Now, the last uh, question for you. You know, having that stretch of holes you had out here, does that give you some confidence going into this tournament oh, that yeah. uh, you can maybe shoot that kind of round out here? Yeah, it, definitely. Because I, I bogeyed one, I bogeyed four. Or bogey three, actually bogey three and four, and those are probably the three easiest holes on the front nine. So you know, I take that, you know, get that back, and uh, you know, it could have been could have been a really good day. So yeah, it builds confidence big big time.